Evolutionary biology is the science of change. There's just something that is fascinating about biological diversity that just creates a sense of curiosity. Where all this is coming from, what's driving it, that curiosity for understanding when all the diversity of life comes from sort of overlap with a sense of urgency for conservation. It's incredibly exciting. This department and this field in general spans a huge range from ecological applications, environmental applications, evolutionary, even to dinosaurs. So it's a huge spectrum, but this uniting theme of how organisms function is really what ties us together, and that's what makes it a special place to work. Our professors treat us like colleagues and they take our ideas really seriously here. To have conversations with ecologists and population geneticists and all these people from across the span of ecology and evolutionary biology is really valuable because you get perspectives that you wouldn't have even imagined. We have a real breadth of interest, but what we share is a passion for training people to think critically about the questions that they're most interested in. And the motivation for that could be purely wanting to understand on a theoretical basis how evolution occurs. Or it could be a motivation to think about how we could possibly make it through the 21st century without catastrophic challenges to both humans and, and all other organisms on the planet. Brown has a very strong culture of intellectual passion, and that permeates every level of its academic structure. Being around this level of science is totally incomparable. The things that I found challenging three years ago seem so trivial now, and I feel like I can take on so much more. It's really this evolution of the student from the day they walk in to the day they leave, and when they leave, you know, they are fully-fledged scientists who are ready to go on and tackle their own questions. You can't do this by a sense of duty. You have to do this with a sense of excitement and curiosity. We have the freedom and the opportunities, in some respects, the responsibility to pursue new ideas, because if you don't, no one else will. The best way to find answers to these challenges is to look outside of the traditional thinking of your field. And, and so that is actually something that makes our department so incredibly competitive. That interaction of those fields that would otherwise look completely separated, but that are heavily, heavily integrated under the umbrella of ecology and evolution to make some incredible science.